गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन वेलकम टू अनदर एपिसोड ऑफ टू द पॉइंट टूडेज टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज कार टी थेरेपी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट सी वाइज इट इन द न्यूज Recently the US Food and Drug Administration announced an investigation to check whether CAR T therapy is causing new cancers in some patients who have undergone the treatment. Now let's discuss about CAR T therapy. CAR T therapy short for chimeric antigen receptor T cell is a cutting edge treatment that reprograms a patient's immune cells to fight cancer. This innovative approach involves taking T cells, a type of white blood cell that plays a crucial role in the immune system, from a patient and modifying them in a laboratory to better recognize and attack cancer cells. These enhanced T cells are then multiplied and infused back into the patient where they seek out and destroy cancer cells. CAR T cell therapy has been approved for leukemias that is cancers arising from the cells that produce white blood cells and lymphomas arising from the lymphatic system now moving on to potential benefits of car t therapy high remission rates for some patients with advanced cancers who have not responded to other treatments car t therapy can lead to higher rates of complete remission targeted treatment CAR T cell therapy is highly targeted as it specifically recognizes and attacks cancer cells expressing the target antigen while sparing healthy cells high efficacy CAR T cell therapy has shown remarkable efficacy particularly in patients with certain types of blood cancers such as acute lymphoblastic leukemia chronic lymphocytic leukemia and non hodgkin lymphoma personalized medicine car t cell therapy can be tailored to each individual patient by engineering t cells to target specific antigens present on their cancer cells now let's have a look at challenges regarding car t cell therapy Cytokine release syndrome or CRS is a systemic inflammatory response triggered by the activation and proliferation of CAR T cells. Treatment with CAR T cell therapy can lead to cytopenias including low levels of red blood cells that is anemia, white blood cells neutropenia and platelets that is thrombocytopenia. Immune effector cell associated syndrome or ICANS encompasses a range of neurological symptoms associated with CAR T cell therapy including confusion, aphasia and seizures. In some cases, rapid destruction of cancer cells following CAR T cell therapy can lead to the release of intracellular contents into the blood stream causing metabolic abnormalities such as hyperkalemia, hyperuricemia and acute kidney injury. Now lastly moving on to way forward The potential uses of CAR T cells are continually expanding offering hope for treating a wide range of diseases However the risk of secondary cancers from CAR T therapy is a serious concern Now is the time for practice question consider the following statements about CAR T cell therapy One CAR T therapy is a cutting edge treatment that reprograms a patient's immune cells to fight cancer. 2. Cytokine release syndrome is triggered by the activation and proliferation of CAR T cells. Which of the statements given above is or are correct? 1 only 2 only both 1 and 2 or neither 1 nor 2. Send the answer of this question in the comment section. Stay tuned for the next episode. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe. and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications